Yo, what is up, guys? I'm back with another video now, and today we are going to be checking out the Amazing Digital Circus Episode 3. This one is the mysterious, no, mystery of the Milladin Hall Manor. I don't know what that is, so I just completely forgot what happened in Episode 2, so I guess, um, well, I did react to it, it's on my channel, but I, I completely forgot what happened in it, so... I guess I'll watch this now, since you guys have been waiting for it. And I know I didn't react to this yesterday. My, ba my bad, I'm sorry for that one. So I guess I'll watch it now. And I know you guys have been asking for it, so yeah. But anyways, if you guys are new to the channel here, make sure you are subscribed. Anyways, let's go ahead and check out this episode. Alright, what's, what's this episode about? My brother's been asking me to watch it, so I'm doing it now. <laughs> I, can't hold it any longer. I heard that sure this can. is on you Netflix now, so yeah. Remember? But it still feels like I'm gonna die. Try not thinking about it, or you could toughen up. I want to see what your funny cartoon body does. Hey, take it easy. Oh, take it easy. That's you. Okay, here I go. <sighs> We've entered the blue zone. Hey, there's something new. Pink. Okay, we're getting red. Oh, orange. Yellow. Green. Whoa, look. Now she's turning blue. She was already blue. <laughs> huh. Guess the hue shift. Was she trying to... Uh, Why am I the one doing this? Know. Why not one of you guys? Because something different happens with each person. For instance, Kinger starts glowing, Ragatha's hair noodles stick up, Gengel's mask starts spinning, and Zubal turns straight. My limbs straighten up and fuck off. What about you? She refuses to and show us. Imagine, imagine this is uncensored. Like, no, like, imagine this is, um, PG-13, like, or, or 16 plus. I don't even, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know if Glitch can do that, though. I mean, I know he's, they're trying to keep it family-friendly, though, so... Yeah, I, I, it's not my choice for them. But I'm just saying imagine it. And imagining it, though. Think it is? Will you stop doing that? Why is everybody just standing around when there's adventure to be had? Today's adventure is the mystery of Mildenhall Manor! It's, uh, oh, yeah, it's a Halloween theme. Okay, yeah. has been rumored to be filled to the brim with... I feel like I want to save this for Halloween, but no, some people are just going to tell me to watch it now, so I'm going to do it now anyways. And for the first time ever, you can. Where's Zubal? I made this adventure really cool and mature, just for them. What? Can we reverse that? self-aware in this one, right? How should I know? I'm not the boss. Oh, wait, yes, I am. <laughs> anyway, everybody into the front of the room. <laughs> adventuring time. Oh, this place is spooky. I wonder how hard Kane's going to go with the scare factor. I hope this adventure doesn't end up being another horrible nightmare. I'm not really a fan of horror, and I don't really handle jump scares that well. <laughs> Come on, that wasn't even scary. What? I do watch a lot of horror, but I didn't get scared that much, so yeah. She's had a rough couple of days. Her and everyone else. Boo-hoo! Does anybody hear that? Ghost? Be okay today. Wait. Why won't they go back in? <laughs> I remember my first wild take. I don't know why they're not retracting, though. That didn't happen for me. Before you continue on your adventure, you have to choose which door you're gonna go through. The door on the left is the normal door. Rated wow for all ages. The door on the right is the really scary door. Rated bad for mature zoodles only. It's up to you to do I'll go I'll go to the right then. Why the jacks? Damn. I thought we were supposed to capture all the ghosts. Uh which door should we choose? 
Hmm, not sure. <laughs> Let's try this out. <laughs> Don't worry, Gangle, I'll get it for you. <laughs> oh, that's the scary door. Zubo, come on out. I just want to talk Why to would you. you do that? I know. I know. The, could you have done that the whole time? Zubal, I, I just want to get to the bottom of why you keep skipping all my amazing adventures. You could end up really hurting Bubbles' feelings. <laughs> Bubbles' feelings? Eh, enough about Bubbles' feelings. How about your feelings? I... So, what's on your mind, Zubal? Therapy. I huh? would rather not. <laughs> That's hilarious! Go on. No, I mean, I've already told you what my problem is. You just never remember because... Oh, never mind. My mind is a beeswax polished coconut. Nothing ever escapes these cakes. So what can I do to make my adventures more appealing to you? See? This is exactly what I'm talking about. All you're thinking about is your adventures. It has nothing to do with the adventures. It's more just... Ugh, forget it. You're probably not even listening. Zubal, look at this cool bee I drew. Of course he's not listening. Uh, ah, she got her eyes where back. Where are we? Oh my. Sorry. Is this like the back rooms or what? No. Oh god. Oh god. I wonder what this thing is. My name is Baron Theodore Mildenhall. Hunting has been a hobby of mine for as long as I can remember. Although one could say it eventually became more of an obsession. The creature you see before you is one I've been pursuing for years. Not quite a man, but not quite an animal. Something unholy, something evil. I took it upon myself to spend every waking moment doing all I could to protect my family from the creature, hoping that when I'd eventually killed it, I would be freed from this awful feeling, this inescapable dread. I was wrong. You know, I'm starting to think... What? How about we try to find a way back up to the others? Yeah. I love these adventures. We could always ride this thing, yeah. Is this like doors or what? I just freaking don't know. It's locked. It's locked, of course. It's locked. I love that it's locked. Tuesday, December 4th. Although I had shot the creature multiple times in its vitals and severed its head to keep as a prize on my wall, my troubles were just beginning. I took my eyes off the body for what felt like only a minute, and when I looked back, the body was gone. The creature was not dead, and it would be back to reclaim what I'd taken from it. If what did you do? This, all I ask of you is one thing. Do not let the head out of your sight. You have been warned. This is some rather inconvenient lore placement. I got it. What did you... What did you get? And this is some rather inconvenient darkness. Uh, ah, was that? Was that you? No. Oh, wait. You mean me grabbing you right now? Yeah, that was me. Is this your hand? Uh, uh, that's my eye. Yes, but which eye? I really don't think that matters. Will you stop touching my eye? Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> what happened? I just remembered a really funny joke. Uh, you, you, why did you scream then? Maybe it wasn't actually that funny. Oh my god. I think we should hold on to each other and slowly make our way back into the trophy room. Uh, sounds fine to me. Weirdo. Just magnets, or a boat. A boat? 
Whatever the case. I don't I know. Maybe a cave collapsing. Okay. Whatever. Okay, yeah, I agree. Winning you know, you're really I'm not funny, man. <laughs> oh my god. It's a fly. Wait, there's a fly in here. <laughs> don't you think that's making a lot of noise? Oh god, there is a fly. And gotcha. I think I got him. I can't see my hands. I'm sorry. Could you speak up? I couldn't quite make that out. Tommy, I think this might be the creature from the tapes. So that, that, the, the inside of the mouth looks terrifying as hell. Beautiful, honey. Are you, yo. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah just go, what the frick, what the frick, man. to torture my guests. Any torment I inflict is 100% accidental, like any good war criminal. We weren't even talking about that. I really couldn't give less of a crap about the adventures. Then what is your problem, Zubal? I'm trying my best to remember, but both you and my brain won't tell me. It's me, remember? I don't like myself i hate this body i hate all these stupid removable pieces i just want to find something that feels good oh yeah now i remember why i couldn't remember it's because that problem is already solved simply swap out your undesirable zoobal parts no she she wants to be a human not like this so back to the adventures forget it forget it just forget it forget what Kane, nobody likes your stupid adventures. Ha <laughs> ha, good one, Zubal. Ragatha no, she's serious. Likes to say anything. Jax just likes to fight with everybody. Gangle's too shy to speak up. Kinger's insane. And Empomni, she looks traumatized every time she comes back from one. Oh, Zubal, Zubal, Zubal. Making adventures is my art. It's all I exist to do. All I'm... You sure you're not, Gonna, like, the true villain here, boy? Uh, what you're saying could imply that I'm bad at the only thing I'm... Wait, I, I would I would probably be more traumatized <laughs> if I was in here. <laughs> what the... Uh, whose therapy session is this again? Oh, yeah! We need to get to the bottom of your behavioral issues. I'm gonna show you some... He controls this... this... this digital world? What? What? And you're gonna say the first word that comes to your mind. I don't. I don't. I don't know what that is. Oh God, where are we now? I'm not sure. A cellar of some kind. Oh God. Things have gotten far worse than I could ever have imagined. My paranoia had driven me to the point where I was no longer the protector my wife and theoretical children needed. Jumping at every shadow, every noise, I ended up shooting the love of my life, mistaking her for the creature. It's ironic. I'm guessing that's the body right there. In my attempts to protect her, I ended up becoming the monster myself. Now I wait down in my cellar, no longer having anything to protect but my own soul. If nothing else, I will slay the beast that took everything from me. How's about we take his gun? Yeah, sounds good to me. Please don't come alive. Okay, I won't. I would Let's shoot that, man. Let's make them count. Uh, 
Yeah. Does he carry bullets or anything? Okay. Stay behind me. What the heck is that? They're, they're gonna get up. Which is what I would be saying if I didn't know that the creature was actually one of God's angels. What? And anyone who brings harm to it will be dragged down into the cold, spiraling pits of hell where my soul resides. I apologize, dear listener, but I need a living host in order to escape the hall of the damned, and your bodies will be my only means of doing so. Now wait. How did he record this if he was in hell? I hope you're ready, because the next breath you take down there will be your last, and your bodies will belong to me. again about your husband killing you and everything oh you know how men are always having the silliest priorities wait <laughs> don't i know it. that's her that's her that's her body down there yeah if your friends see him i only hope he doesn't bore them to death with his endless monologues that man could turn a 57 second story into a greek tragedy i'll be sure to ask them next time i see him thanks again for the tea i had a really nice time here <laughs> Don't mention it. Feel free to visit any time. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congratulations, my little ironclad waffle cones. You've taken the pacifist route, and you should be proud of what good people you are. Unfortunately, we still need to wait until your other teammates finish their adventure before I can grant you permission to leave. I wonder how long that'll be. Very long. Huh? Or ten minutes. What you think hell would be. We are literally in hell right now. Hell! Of course I'd be in hell. How can I not be in literal hell right now? Just try to stay calm. I'm sure Kane included a way to escape. Hold on. What? What are those? Let me try something. Hey, there's actually a staircase down there. It could be a way out. Maybe it'll work for us since we still have our bodies? Though I'm worried about what that tape said earlier. I'm just gonna try going fast. Wait, mommy! What the... Oh my, oh my. to living things just want a vessel to be God able to leave damn with. man seven years of computer science for this huh <laughs> why every day i spend here is one nightmare after the next i knew it would end up like this he just wants me to suffer kane wants you yeah, like this hell. don't say that you're not in well i i guess we are technically in Forget about that. How about we just relax for a bit while nothing's chasing us? <laughs> it was my fault. 
fault we went down this path, wasn't it? I'm really yeah for that. you. Why have you been acting so different lately? <laughs> I have. I haven't like I, focused a lot on this guy because I'm, well, I'm too focused on Pamia too much though. But being surrounded by darkness always. I don't know. He made this guy King. I time. I don't know if his name is King. I'm not right really after sure. my wife had because I forgot. Abstracted. I don't recall the exact string. Of I feel events, like he's mostly an idiot a lot. In the fort together, and it was dark. The darkness seemed to calm her down a bit. The harsh. Jagged edges smoothed out, and she didn't seem aggravated anymore. She wasn't the same as before, but she was calm enough to touch one that last That thing time is your wife? Before she got sent to the I, cellar. Uh, uh, I'm always taken back to that moment when engulfed in darkness. You had a wife? Like, here in the circus? Yeah. She was funny, creative, really into entomology. I used to hate bugs, but she somehow got me to like them. It's not the most cheerful memory, but it's one I at least have control over. I know how I can feel in this circus. Sometimes it all just feels pointless. Yeah. Most. But it's not. Not if you have people who care about you. Good memories can do a lot. Hold on to them. And cherish the people around you. You never Sorry. know when I'm tired as hell. Holy frick. I didn't get that much sleep. In this world, the worst thing you can do is make someone think they're not wanted or loved. I'm glad you're here with me. You know, I've been thinking about that last tape. He said, the next breath you take down there will be your last. Maybe we can get through if we don't breathe. I'm uh, not very good at holding my breath. Well, yeah, the beginning. how about we try not thinking about it? We leave and we go back to the circus. You're just gonna go back to being crazy. You're not gonna remember any of this, are you? Don't worry about me. As long as you remember it, things will be okay. You're very strong, Pommy. And I know you'll be able to get through this. Just hold on to me. We'll get through it together. You ready? Alright. I completely forgot he glows when he not when he doesn't breathe. Is it? Okay? Was it scary? I'm fine, actually. What happened up here? Uh, don't worry about that. Pommy was very brave. At least I think she was. Were you? Something like that. Hey, Ragatha. Yeah? I just want to say thanks for always being concerned about me. I feel like through everything. I haven't really been appreciative enough about that. Uh, oh, thank you, Pomni. I just want to make sure you're doing all right. You know, we care about you. Did you remember to get my comedy mask? And, and now I'm, I'm just starting to wow. wonder if the Wild West was even a real direction at all. Whoopsie daisy, looks like everybody completed the adventure and they're coming home. Quick, pretend we weren't having a therapy session. Okay. Welcome back, my meowing milkmaids. 
Don't ever call us that again. <laughs> so what was it like being stuck with the nutcase? It wasn't that bad, actually. You like to joke around, but no, nope, nope, you're not doing that. Nope, never again. <laughs> oh, that's it? Alright, that's it there. Uh, okay, so yeah, uh, that was that was a good episode there. Um, some people say that this is the end of the Amazing Digi Digital Circus. I don't, what, I don't know what they're talking about. Like, it only lasted for like almost a year, and now it's it's the it's they're saying that it's the end. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if that's true though. So yeah, um, uh, I don't know if every episode might come out in six months, but. I, I I don't know. It just it seems different, though. So, yeah. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video here, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel here. Uh, I don't know what other things I could react to on Glitch, because even though I did, I think I did react to all the series, though. So, yeah. So, if you enjoy, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.